Previously on Baby Teeth 4. Somebody make it stop! I got a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. Are you a good witch or a bad witch? I'm not a witch at all. <laughs> We'd better give you the ruby slippers. What? It's easy to go to Oz. All you have to do is follow that yellow brick road. I'm gonna go see the Wizard of Oz. He's supposed to be able to help send me home. Oh, do you think maybe he could get me a brain too? I was thinking of going to see the wizard on account of I don't have a heart. Oh no, the wicked witch of the west. You killed my sister, and now I'll get you, my pretty, and your little dog too. First things first, hand over those ruby slippers. Better do as she says, Dorothy. But Glinda the good witch said to keep them. And I, the wicked witch, is saying to turn them over, now. Hmm, they won't come off. Uh, I gotta do everything myself. Ow! You've bewitched the shoes. I swear I haven't. Wait, what y'all this about the shoes? You hand those shoes over. I'm even willing to trade. Ooh, those are pretty nice. No, these shoes surely have a lot of power, and you'll do nothing good with them. Fine, have it your way. There's other ways to get those shoes. I'll get you, my pretty, and your little dog, too. <laughs> Man, she's really got something against this dog. Wait, we have a dog with us, too? Wow, people come and go awfully fast in this place. What do you think we should do next, Dorothy? We should just keep following the yellow brick road. Sounds good. Whoa, what's this place? I don't know. How about you, Tin Woodsman? Oh, I remember this part of the forest. There were a lot of wild animals. You know, lions. And tigers. And bears, oh my. Dorothy, look! Roar! It's a little lion! Little? Why, I oughta... Don't worry, Dorothy, we'll protect you. I'd like to see him bite through my tin. Tin? That looks like aluminum foil. I'm gonna unwrap you like a burrito. Hey, buddy, why don't you pick on someone your own size? Ooh, mm, Scarecrow, I'm so scared. Well, why don't you let us pass? This isn't your forest. I am the king of the forest, and you must obey my rules. Look, we don't want any trouble. We just want to go to Emerald City. Oh, what was that? The burrito said something about Emerald City. We're going to see the Wizard of Oz. He's going to help me get home. <coughs> Wait a minute. What is that thing? What? You mean Toto? Why, you're not afraid of a little doggy, are you? Who, me? The king of the forest? Afraid of that thing? Of course not. Now, you three just be on your way. Ha! He is afraid! Sick him, Toto! Toto! Uh, get him off me! Get him off me! Toto, you get back here! Okay. Okay. Deep breaths, everybody. Deep breaths. Boy, he sure is afraid, isn't he? Ha! I never heard of a cowardly lion before. Yeah, I'm not cowardly. I just have an abundance of caution. Well, maybe the wizard can help you find your courage. That's a good idea, Dorothy. Maybe he could. He's gonna help me get my brain. Yeah, and he's gonna give me a heart for some reason. Yeah, well, maybe I will join you three. You look like you could use a hand anyway. Of course you can join us, and Toto will promise to be nice to you, won't you, Toto? <laughs> well then, I guess we're off. Off to see the wizard. I'm going to get courage. I'm going to get courage. We're going to see the wizard, and I'm going to get courage. Whoa, little buddy, are you ready? 
But the Wicked Witch was hatching an evil plan back in her lair. The ruby slippers will not come off of her while she is alive. So I will enchant a field of poppies. 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 Your Highness, there are no more poppies left in that field. What? Okay, change of plans. We'll enchant a single rose. A rose. A rose. Look, a single rose. It sure is a pretty rose. I just want to go and see what it smells like. But when Dorothy smelled the rose, she fell fast asleep. Dorothy! Dorothy, Dorothy, wake up! Wake up! Oh, somebody help us! Somebody help us! Yeah, maybe I could do something. And so the lion tickled Dorothy's face with his whiskers. Come on, get up, get up, come on. What is that? What happened? That rose must have been enchanted, because when you smelled it, you just fell right asleep. Well, I'm okay now. Come on, Toto. Yeah, and our new friend, the lion, helped wake you up. Hmm, it was no big deal, really. You'd have done the same for me. Thank you, lion. I feel much better now. Let's go to Emerald City. Look, it's the gateway to Emerald City. Well, how do you know that, Dorothy? Boy, you really don't have a brain, do you? Halt! Who goes there? Whoa, Talking Tree! Weren't you supposed to come in before the Tin Man scene? Uh, never mind that. What business brings you here today? Oh, we'd like to go into Emerald City, please. Well, no, the city's closed, so um, come back maybe uh, next week or uh, next month. Maybe even later. Goodbye! Oh no, but we came so far. You have to let us in. <laughs> Gee, mister, I just need to get my brain. She just wants to go home. And these guys have other issues. Yeah, I need a heart. And I need courage. And my appearance keeps changing for no apparent reason. Please, mister, if you don't let us in, I'll cry. <sighs> okay, well, that was really annoying, and, uh, you guys actually frightened me a little bit, so, um, go ahead. Emerald City, I guess. Look, I think the wizard's over there. Come on. Who dares to disturb Oz the Great and Terrible? We're sorry, the Great and Terrible Oz, but I really need you to help me get home. <laughs> and I sure could use a, a brain, and um, I, I think he needs a heart, and um, he needs courage. <laughs> Silence! You dare to make a request of me? What do you offer in return? Oh, um, offer in return? Well, I don't have any money. I mean, I guess I have these ruby slippers that everyone seems to want, but nobody can seem to get them off my feet. Ah, the ruby slippers. They belong to the Wicked Witch of the East. Oh, she isn't around anymore. Dorothy's house fell on her. Squished her flat. Anyone powerful enough to sway the Wicked Witch of the East could also sway the Wicked Witch of the West. Uh, I think my witch slaying days are over. I really didn't have anything against them, besides them being wicked and all. Sirens, if you want your wishes to be granted, then you must return with the Wicked Witch of the West broomstick. Yeah, I don't see her just handing that over to us. What's a broomstick? If you want your wishes to be granted, then you must do as I say. Be gone! Oh no. Will Dorothy be able to get the broomstick belonging to the Wicked Witch of the West? 
Will Toto whimper uncontrollably? Will the Scarecrow be of any use whatsoever? Will the Tin Man get a heart and possibly a better outfit? Will anyone be able to explain why the Cowardly Lion keeps changing his appearance? You can get answers to all these questions next week right here on the Baby Teeth 4 channel. So that was part two of The Wizard of Oz, and if you liked it, click up that thumbs up button, it really helps. Hey, are you following Baby Teeth 4 on Instagram? If you're not, you're missing out. We post new pictures, stories, and videos every day. Yeah, and be sure to check out our other two channels, Baby Teeth More and the Jillian and Addie channel. They're a real hoot. See you guys next week. Bye!